This is the next 1000X cryptocurrency. Welcome back to the channel and if you're new here welcome my name is Spencer Van and this is a follow-up video to a video I did last week talking about this new crypto I just bought FEG um, and last week I had made 17k well I have an update I've now made 70 70k $70,000 and I think it's gonna go a lot higher than that um, now of course full disclaimer of course I own this coin as I just said um, so just a heads up there and this is about financial advice Blah, 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 do your research. Don't listen to me, I'm just a drunk baboon talking to you right now. Anyways, um, but I'm excited because I'm gonna share with you some updates as why I think this is gonna continue to rise and why I'm so excited about this coin. So if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell because once per month, I actually give away some courses on how you can make money so you have more money to invest in crypto, but also just do whatever you want with it. If you're new here or not new here, make sure you click the like button down below so you can see more videos like this one, but let's jump into it. So the token we're gonna talk about today is kind of a meme coin. So the idea is create a coin that is deflationary that also provides rewards to its holders. And so the name of the coin is FEG, it stands for Feed Every Gorilla. Now, a lot of the videos that talk about FEG on YouTube, I've seen like a lot of them, they just like scroll through the website. We're gonna be doing a lot more than that in this video. I'm gonna be talking about my actual personal opinion on why I think this is gonna go up so much. But to give you the quick premise of it, I'm gonna go through the website for a second. So basically, there's a few major things that make this coin and make this cryptocurrency so spectacular, okay? Obviously decentralized, that's all pretty straightforward. Okay, burn rate. So every time someone buys or sells, 1% of that transaction is burned and removed from existence, right? Um, that would be the equivalent of like every time someone buys or sells, you know, with the US dollars, the government takes 1% of that transaction and just burns it, throws it away. That means the value of your money, the value of this coin goes up over time because there's less of it, right? Hypothetically speaking. Um, and then the other, the other cool thing is they also have another 1% tax, so it's 2% um, on each transaction. That second 1% is a tax. So up to date, let's see how much I've actually made um, from the tax. Just full disclosure, I have 125 trillion FEG token, but I've earned just over 1 trillion um, in FEG uh, from just holding, from just not selling, right? Um, and I am in the top 50, I looked up on Etherscan, I'm in the top 50 of wallet holders. So, uh, pretty exciting. I, I guess I guess I'm a while. I guess that makes me a while. But <laughs> anyways, um, moral of the story is is that you can actually earn more Feg literally by just holding, and so it incentivizes people to hold longer. Um, and then the other cool thing is that, and um, this is where we go into kind of some of my my personal opinion on it and some of my theory on it, is the people that are making this Feg coin and and developing and working on this project are um, very serious about this. Like, it's a, it's a meme coin, yes, okay? But they're not joking around. And for example, I mean, I just uh, pulled up the, the web, or the, the, the mobile tracking app for FEG, but we're also getting pretty close to the launch of FEGX. And FEGX is deemed the, the Uniswap killer. So if you don't know what Uniswap is, this is Uniswap right, uh, Uniswap right here. It's a decentralized uh, trading platform. Basically, you can trade one coin for another, and it's, Pretty much where if any you know regular crypto traders used uh, Uniswap at one point, um, and Uniswap is great, but there's a lot of problems with Uniswap, um, and Feg, the developers of Feg are hoping to fix that. And the really cool thing is, and this is kind of a rumor, and I don't know if this is true or not, so don't quote me. This may be completely wrong, but um, I've heard rumors and I've seen some potential evidence of this that uh, potentially the developers of Feg, of FegX, and the and the you know Feg Swap the new swapping um, platform for FEG, apparently some of those same developers worked on Uniswap. Um, and, you know, there's some IP addresses that are coming up as the same. There's some, you know, same owned domain. So I don't know if that's true or not. It might just be fake, but it does seem rather interesting uh, if that is the case, and it seems very bullish for FEG. Um, but regardless whether they are the same developers or not, I, I truly believe that by fixing some of the main issues with Uniswap, and on top of that, adding... Uh, you know, incentive for people to use it because they can earn rewards and adding incentive to hold because not only are they earning rewards, but they're also burning. So, right, so there's higher value for each coin because a little bit is getting removed on every transaction. Um, I really could see this coin exploding from here. 
Um, and I want to talk a little bit about their Twitter too. So there's a lot of memes on here. So another thing I want to talk about too is there's actually two versions of FEG. So there's one on the Ethereum blockchain, there's one on the Binance chain. And so right now the Ethereum chain is actually up in price, um, but there is a lot less holders on Ethereum. So there's only about 6K holders. At one point it was 9K. Um, and that's where mine is, is on the Ethereum chain. And then the Binance chain, they've got you know, almost 14,500 members, or uh, holders rather. So um, quite impressive how fast that's going. You see almost 1,000 new holders uh, in the last 24 hours. Um, and the trading volume for the Ethereum is 1.1 million um, 24 hours. Uh, and for Binance, it's almost 3 million, uh, which is pretty impressive. Um, and then tokens burn, you can see on the Ethereum side, 56 quadrillion, and on the uh, Binance side, 53 quadrillion. And then uh, reward pot, uh, market cap. So market cap on Ethereum is almost twice uh, what it is on Binance. So uh, my personal opinion on this is I think the Binance one might be a little bit undervalued, especially because the Ethereum uh, you know, gas fees are just so ridiculous right now. Um, and yeah, I, I think the Binance one might be a little bit undervalued. I kind of wish I had some Binance at this point. I think it's a little bit too late for me to buy some more um, because I, I want to buy in like 100 trillion quantities. I don't really want to pay 70K <laughs> for 100 trillion. Um, but if you want, just getting into it, I still think it has potentially uh, the potential to go up 10, 20, 30, 40, 50X. You know, some guys are saying it's going to go up 1,000X from here. I don't know if that's going to happen. I mean, you, know, you look at the market cap, if it went up 1,000x from here, you're talking about 200 million would be 10x, 2 billion would be 100x. So you're talking about a 20 billion market cap, which would put it you know, very easily in the top 30 of cryptos. Um, so I'm not saying it's not possible. I'm sure it's possible, but uh, I don't think it's going to happen within the next year or so. Now, could it go up 10, 20, 30, 40, 50x? Absolutely. I think it could. Um, and again, that's not financial advice. Um, but there's a reason why I'm holding, right? <laughs> I've made 70K profit already. Just to give you full clarification, I put in $3,000 um, roughly. And that turned in at one point as 107,000, dropped back down to 50. Now it's trending around 70, 75. I'm recording this video and I think it's going to go a lot higher than that. So I'm holding. But, um, you know, again, I think there's definitely some incentive still to get into it if you do your research, not financial advice, as I said. So they actually do have this cool video too online of what FegX is going to uh, to look like when it when it when it launches. So it's got a really cool UI, and the beta is already up too. The beta uh, for FegX is already up on the Binance chain. Uh, it just doesn't the, the the Ethereum chain's not up, and then also um, you know the, the full UI is not done. So they are working on it. Um, they're saying it's going to be released sometime in mid March. As I'm recording this, it's March 14th. So, I mean, it could be within the next week or two here. Um, but very excited about this. Um, and then, of course, I want to take a look at just the chart, too. And Guys, I'm not a crypto expert, so, you know, I don't understand technical analysis and all that. But you can see here, um, you know, originally when it launched, there was a little bit of a boom right here. And then it flatlined for a little, for, for a little while. And then uh, about two weeks ago or so, there was a pretty big spike right here. Um, and I got in about right here, okay? Pretty big spike right here, and then I was gonna get out somewhere going up. Obviously, I didn't have time. It didn't, you know, didn't get to it in time. So I just said, ah, oh, let's leave it in. And it was trending uh, right here. It was kind of trending upwards. So I was like, okay, like that's pretty good. And then, boom! Last weekend, it just totally shot up. And at one, like I said, at one point, it was worth like 107 to 110 thousand. For my 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 investment was um, the actual coin price. I don't really know what that was, but. Um, anyways, and then uh, you can see now it's trending here. It's kind of going up and down, but it's trending overall upwards. Um, for, you know, if you look here at the dips, so you see like, look at the bottom here. Uh, right here, you see it's right above this line, and those are right above this line, and then boom, the bottom here is right below this line, and then boom, the bottom here is right above that line. So it's trending upwards if you look at the, at the uh, you know, what's it called, like the, the, the bottom end of it. Um, so that's interesting. I think there's a pretty strong support line there. Um, and excited down a little bit today, 28%. Um, but listen, you know, you don't get it all coins for you know a consistent 2%. You get it all coins for you're down 28%. That goes up 2,000%. So, um, so yeah. And then the cool thing is we can actually check out Ether Scan so we can see how many holders there are. So I believe that number we had right is 6,140 holders. You can see they've already burned 56 quadrillion tokens. And the really cool thing too is there's not one person that owns more than like one person, I mean, you know, 2%, right? So this guy is the number one holder and he only owns 1.8%. So that's pretty good. That means that there's no one that can just, you know, pull, pull all the liquidity out and pull, 
um, you know, all, all the tokens off the market, basically. Um, so that's pretty much it, guys. I mean, hopefully this makes sense. Um, you know, obviously do your research. Um, you know, something I've been getting into recently. I'm fairly new to crypto, so don't judge me too hard uh, on my terminology. And if I said anything wrong, just let me know in the comments because I am new to crypto. But um, with that being said, super excited about FEG. Um, you know, maybe I'll do another video on like how I choose altcoins to invest in because I think that would be interesting for you guys. Um, but if you like this video, click the like button down below. Comment your thoughts. Are you excited about FEG? Um, and uh, if so, you know, what's your, what's your plan? Are you staying in? Have you bought? Have you not bought? Um, and with that being said, I will see you on the next video.